Hi, so I'm going to be showing you how to connect the Scarlett Solo Studio to an iPhone or iPad. So many people believe that you can only record music if you have a you know MacBook or even a Windows laptop. But no, you can do it on your mobile device also. So I'm going to be showing you how to set it up. This is the USB interface. Um, as you can see, it's bright red. It has a three pin uh, input here. It has a jack input here and a headphone jack input here also. It has the monitor volume and volumes for these two different inputs. Uh, at the back, this is where you put in the power cable and there's some other um, outputs there. This is the microphone that comes with the uh, set. Very good, very good microphone. So I'm going to connect the microphone by putting in this three pin lead into here. Now that that's in, the microphone is now connected. Next, I'm actually going to be powering it up. To do this, I'm going to be using the micro USB to USB cable that came with the set. So first step, obviously plug in the micro USB into the USB interface. Next, you're going to need one of these Apple Lightning to USB 3 camera adapters. I got an actual Apple one rather than like an unofficial one because obviously I don't know how much power the unofficial ones can take. So I just got the original Apple one. And this was about £33 from Amazon. So I've connected the USB to this USB 3 camera adapter. Next, I'm going to be connecting the USB 3 camera adapter to your normal power source. So I'm just going to use a normal uh, iPhone cable, not USB-C, just a normal iPhone cable, not the original. And so the setup should look like this. So under this gold jack, there is a normal headphone jack uh, plug. You just unscrew that. I'll show you that now. So if you unscrew the gold jack, here's the normal headphone jack. So now the headphones are plugged in and the setup is almost complete. I just have to connect the USB 3 camera adapter to my iPhone. And now I'm going to screen record me on GarageBand to show you how it works. Currently recording and processing making. So I'm going to turn on the microphone. It asks me um, if I want to turn on monitoring because there's detected an audio device that's been connected. And of course I'm going to press turn on monitoring. Anyway, I'm going to try and attempt to record. Hopefully you can hear me well and good. I'm going to play that back now. So that's literally all you have to do is to get this set working like i really highly recommend it um i'm a new artist trying to make music and i feel like it's very convenient very good quality and very good for your money i really recommend scarlet focus right solo studio bundle uh have a good day bye